What's up? What's up? What's up? You already know. The speech. And today we're standing behind my future home. This is the home my husband and I want to purchase. Let me show y'all what it looks like. Now this home is $1.2 million. It's like almost close to 1.3 million. This is the Madeira model by West Bay. You get a three car garage, which we love. So we can park our cars here. And then over here, we can put all of the kids, uh, dirt bikes and sprees, etc. And we like that it's split. Instead of that standard three car garage where everything is close together, we love the fact that the kids could have their own garage. It does have windows. They can go in there and get their bikes and toys and stuff. And then we can literally park our cars. That's a big one for us. Now, West Bay does not make six bedrooms. Womp, womp, womp. But the home is over 4,000 square feet. And it's a lot of space. And you can turn rooms into bedrooms if you like. So when we first walk in, this is your entryway. You can change the chandelier if you like. Over here is that garage where all the kids' toys can go. They are repainting in here so I can smell the paint. Got to be careful with what I touch. Over here is the entrance with the two-car garage. Now, this home is done. If you want to design... Oh, I thought it was a two-car. This is a coat closet. Uh, if you want to design your own home, you have to do it. I think it's 21 days before a certain phase. I forget what phase it is. But this home is complete. Like, we can buy this house right now and this was exactly what it would look like and we would have to make the changes on our own because it's now finished over here we have a flex room which would be my office my husband and I's office okay and then over here you have your formal dining room you can see from the chandelier which we would change the crown molding comes like this, guys. The black windows, it comes like this. So this is like a standard house, has not been designed by anybody but the company. No upgrades. Okay, guys, so over here, I thought you would have to get this customized. Like, I know you could add this, but it came with the house. So I love that. Like, we could literally put all the kids here for breakfast. Um, the whole family could eat dinner here. We wouldn't have to get a formal table if we didn't want to. We could turn that room into something else if we would like. Over here, you have your cabinet space for your pots. What you'll notice in these kind of homes, they don't really do the cabinets like these. Like how you see in normal homes where every cabinet's like that, it's more so pullouts. So you can just pull out your pots and stuff. Gas stove. Got your oven and your microwave. Pantry. The pantry is small. I say I think when it comes to more expensive homes, people don't really cook that often. So the pantries get smaller as the homes get bigger. Um, it's just something I've noticed. We have a kitchen window. And your neighbor is far, guys. All of that grass is your yard. So the neighbor is pretty far. Over here, we have the pool. Now, the pool here, that's why I said that at the model home, the pool was huge. The pool here isn't as big. It could have been bigger. It could have came all the way back here and been as wide. Uh, but they put this pool here, so it's included. This is like the standard size pool. Now, I did ask her about playgrounds and trampolines. She said she has to ask because your playground, they have a rule your playground can't be taller than your fence. So that would make it difficult to add a playground here. That's one of the things about living in a community that has a HOA. I think that's a turtle. That's a turtle over there, and I'm scared. Um, living in a community with an HOA is that you have to follow certain rules and regulations. Let's come out here. So all of this would be our yard. And then she said that this is a green area. All of this would be my yard all the way up to that blue stick. And then this is a green area. So they would never put anything here, not gonna build any houses. It would just be a green Marie area just to see some green grass. Now this is the reason why we love this home 
So all the way to the stake is your yard. Our yard. Let me say that. Our yard. This is going to be our house. Um, With this, this is why my husband and I like this model. Is because we want that balcony upstairs. We can come out. We can look. We can see the kids out here playing with their dog. Even though my husband said we can't get a dog. We get a dog. And I can see my children out here playing with their toys. And see them in the pool if I don't want to come out here. And it's just a beautiful scene. We like this community better. I showed you guys Triple Creek. We like Triple Creek if you're going to get like a cheaper home. If you're going to go with Lennar, Casa Fresca, yeah, Triple Creek. But if you're going to pay a million dollars, which Triple Creek does have homes over there for a million dollars. If I'm going to pay $1.2 million for a home, I want to look around the neighborhood and I want everybody else to have a million dollar home or these homes start at nine hundred thousand. That's the cheapest home you could buy there, a nine hundred thousand dollar home. I wouldn't want to look out of my front door or off of my balcony and see a home that's three hundred thousand dollars. You could say I'm crazy. Look at the cranes. You could say I'm crazy, but that's just me. I feel like I would rather live where all my neighbors are making good money. This is how the fences must be over here. They have to be black. So your playground wouldn't be able to be bigger. I love the trees in their backyard. Uh, wouldn't be able to be bigger than the fence, which that would be a challenge. And as far as trampoline, she said she got to see about that as well. Now, for those of you like, well, those fences don't have any privacy. You can put you some bushes, some hedges around the fence to have it private and they can grow. And that's how you'll have your privacy. It did that pool better. That pool is longer and it's centered. Y'all see that? Versus this pool. Okay, the crane's going crazy versus this pool it's weird i wonder why they did it that way they just put it a little one off to the side instead of making it centered very very weird and not as long as that pool i would want a long pool like that one. what's going on all right let's go back inside i love these pants my husband hate them come over here so i can shut the door i'm so happy with the way the market is starting to change, like listening to my husband to wait to purchase because I'm starting to see prices go down. We're starting to see builders have inventory homes. A year ago, even a few months ago, this was unheard of where you can find a home like this. It's ready to go. We can put an offer in and close in like 10 days and move in. That was unheard of. Now it's becoming more and more common and you can get a lot of incentives thanks to the interest rates rising. All right, so here is your half, I mean, full bath, your pool bath. This house has, I believe, four and a half baths. So you have your shower, which we would probably add a glass. Still nice. Throne room with a window. Love that the bathrooms have windows. Over here, you can call this like your mother-in-law suite. Normally, that's what this room is called traditionally because your parents might get old and they might have to stay with you all. And you want them downstairs. So this is bedroom number one. You want them downstairs in case, you know, they need a wheelchair or something like that. Which is why this room is often referred to as the mother-in-law suite. It's private. They got a bathroom still right by the kitchen and it's downstairs. All right, guys, over here is where the two-car garage entrance would be. So I was wrong earlier. Excuse me. Very similar to, I believe, the West Shore of the Belmar, where you come in a garage and you have this walkway with your half bath. So if you like me and you always got to use the restroom as soon as you come home, this is perfect. And then you can overlook your living room. Put you some little cute knickknacks here. Leave the keys, maybe. Let's go upstairs and see the other four bedrooms. These are the stairs, which I don't like. I don't like the white and the brown. I don't like the flooring. But these are the stairs, and it's done. You could always get it painted black and change it to the wood that you want. It's nice to see what a house would come like for um west bay this is my first time seeing a home that isn't designed by you and seeing it just how it comes they have to paint that to the brown but over here we have a huge loft it's really big this might be to put um you a wet bar in the piping i'm gonna assume so this is what we want that balcony 
<laughs> this is why we want this home. It's a big one for my husband. It's like number one on his list. Just hate how they put the pool. Like, why would y'all not center the pool? That's crazy. Look at the neighbors. They pool so long. But you can come out here and just look at the kids. Like, oh, okay. Come out there be like, choice, choice. Let your brother go. Let him go now. You know. <laughs> uh, why are you still chilling upstairs? All right, so that's your big loft. We're going to start over here. We'll end with the master suite. So we're going to go over here to nook number one. Comment down below if y'all think this house is worth $1.2 million. Nook number one, this is the room. It's little. It does have two windows, which I like. I love the black. The black, I love that. It got two closets, but they connect to make it one. So it's just two doors. You can definitely... Still put two twin beds in here if you like, but I don't know where you would put their TVs if you put them this way, because the closets. And then if you just put one bed here, it still would be a little weird. So this room is shaped a little funny, looking at it from this perspective, because how are you gonna put the TV on this little wall unless it's gonna be a little TV or you're gonna pop it out? Anyways, over here, you have your bathroom with the Jack and Jill sinks, tub. This is what it looks like, standard tile. Put your soap and body wash right there. Toilet, double closets. Again, this room only has one window. One window. You can put the bed right here, TV right there. So that's three bedrooms that we've seen. All right, over here, another full bath, one sink. You can close the door and just brush your teeth. Bedroom number four. So, okay, size. I would put the bed here and then this. So, look, the Lennar Trenton model, functionality wise, it has what we need. This is your laundry room. It's a six bedroom. Lennar is one of the only builders still building six and seven bedrooms. No other builder is doing that. They're only building fives. I'm sure. HVAC and stuff. So you got one room downstairs, uh, three rooms on this side with two baths. And then over here is your master suite. This is the master. Looks regular size room. And you can come out here on your balcony, which is perfect. That's what me and my husband want. This is like the top priority for daddy. Daddy want a balcony up top. He don't really want to settle. Over here. Here's your closet, number one. And then here's the tub. Soaking tub. I do not like that. I think that is so ugly. Like, why would you put this? Oh, I don't like it. This one wouldn't be my house. I'll have to design mine because that's not giving what's supposed to be getting. And here's your shower. Hopefully, they're going to come through and add the glasses because that would be necessary. Two shower heads and then your throne room. You do have a window in here. I don't know now. Now that I'm in here, it's like, this is ugly. I don't like that at all. Got your archways. Comment down below how y'all feel about this house. 1.2 million. The Lennar home that we saw at the Trenton, that home is 440,000, but they won't have any until April. Um, If you get it in a different county, they're only $369,000 in another county. You won't have a pool and the community will be mixed. It will be diverse. However, you would be able to put a playground and you would have six bedrooms. This house is over 4,000 uh, square feet, but it's only five bedroom, four and a half baths. 
So, Peach Patch, tell me what you think. Are you impressed? Should we get this type of home? Should we just go ahead and get the Lenar Trenton because of functionality and spacing with a big family? Comment down below how y'all feel. I'm gonna give y'all a tour of the neighborhood. Walking out, guys, this is what you see. And you got a lot of space. We do love that. You see, they put hedges. They're putting their hedges, and they're probably gonna come back and add their gate. Unless they're just only gonna do hedges. That's gonna be their privacy. I done left my keys in the house. But we just love West Bay. We love West Bay homes. The artisan collection. And Peach Trash, the HOA, they have no CDD, but they do have an HOA. The HOA over here is $500 a month. And that could change, guys. It's not like a locked in rate for the life. It could change. I'm sorry, I messed up. The HOA is $500 every three months. So you're gonna pay $2,000 a year and HOA fees. Now this community will not have a community park or a community pool. When you get into the Artisan Collection, which is like the Lux series, mostly all of the homes have their own pools or capability to have their own pool. So there's no need to build pools. All right, guys, and just so you guys can see, you have a good little bit of space between you and your neighbors. There's not that many homes over here because they're in their first phase. They're about to start building phase two. This is the other home that's available, which is another Madeira. We love the Madeiras. Now this same type of home in a regular community, it's only like 619,000. If you wanna live in a regular community that's not gated, that's mixed, you could get that same type of home for less money. I'll show y'all. People are buying these bad boys. That's just that. Y'all see what y'all neighbors would be driving. Baby, they got money over here. They got money, money. All right, Peace Patch. More views of the neighborhood. Like, you know, this is private. Don't solicit us. So. We love the Madeiras. It's so pretty. I'm so happy builders are back including pools. Because that suck. And all that money and no pool. We got a cul de stop with a water view. And that's it so far for this community. So they're only in phase one. They're developing this in two phases. Once phase one is done, they're actually starting in the back now in phase two. It's gonna be 120 something homes. Gated community. All homes starting at at least 900,000. And Peach Patch, this is what you would be living next to. Well, us, you'd be out in the boonies in the middle of nowhere, honey. They don't even got street lights out around these parts. Now, a little further up, you will be in Fish Hawk where it's more development and more development happening. Fish Hawk, one of the hottest zip codes and areas to be in. Lucky like, hit a lucky like, hit a lucky like for your girl. You like my pictures, hit a lucky like. You like my videos, hit a lucky like. You ain't no hater, hit a lucky like. You getting paper, hit a lucky like. Go like, 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 let's go. You know your girl funny, yeah, you know your girl That's dope right. If you really like me, why wouldn't you hit it, yo? L to the I-K, E-Y, babe Hit her like he like and send that love my way L to the I-K, E-Y, babe Hit her like he like and send that love my way Like, 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 let's go Like, 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 with a like, rock with a like, to the left, to the right, go like, 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 Australia better like, 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 US better like, 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 UK, hit a like, a like, a like, hit a like, a like, 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 hit a like, 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 for your girl, take it back to the like, 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 from the left to the right, go like, 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 Scotland better like, 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 
hit a light, hit a light, go left, hit a right, go light, 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 like Africa, go light, 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 like Africa, go like, 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 I hope y'all like this sound. Yeah, that's right, hit a like, you like for your girl, thanks for joking, bye.